again. Yo, what? You'll try and kill me? You already have. Twice, no. Now it's my turn to return the favor. arrested him yet. Who? Who? Caleb Morley. John McBain. Listen to me. He is so dangerous. You have got to arrest him. He is a homicidal maniac. Lady, you're the only maniac around here. No, wait. Please listen to me. He is dangerous. He's seductive. He will not stop till he destroys this whole town. Listen to me. Lucy. No. Anybody out there, will you please listen? The undead, they're walking among us, especially here. You, you know that detective? Well, he's not your detective. He happens to be king of the vampires. We have to stop him. Can I help you? Oh, my goodness. Duke. Duke. Slavery. Yes. I was passing and I heard you. Oh, oh, it's so good to see you. No one in here will believe me. Lucy, what can I do for you? Okay, first, listen, you have to be really, really careful because he works here. Who works here? There's a man that I knew a long time ago, and I happened to see him, and I realized who he was, and he's very dangerous. He's infiltrated. <gasps> Wait a minute. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no. You're not Duke. Lucy, I understand you'd be confused, but I'm not Cesar Faison. Faison? Why... Why would I think you were him? Well, you didn't think I was Duke Lavery. Right? You're not Duke Lavery. Duke is dead. May he rest in peace. You're Joshua Temple. Who is Joshua Temple? Caleb's assistant. He's one of them. You're one of them. You're one of the undead. In a manner of speaking, you may... Guard! Guard, you have left me alone in here with a vampire. Uh, 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 Lucy, oh, I was... I was never dead. I was... Dead. I, I have something with everything in battle. Lucy, I am Duke Lavery. I am your friend. You're not my friend. You'll never be my friend. You're not my friend. Lucy. Lucy. I came as soon as I heard you were arrested. Oh, my God. Thank, thank God. Listen to me. You've got to get away from him. Get away from him, please. Y you mean Duke? He's not Duke. That's not his name. I, I can assure you I am Duke. I can understand the confusion, but I am... Duke. Oh, well, oh, I'm not confused. Anna called and, and Matt told us the whole story. I'm, I'm actually glad to see you after all these years. It's, it's nice to see you. Welcome home. Well, thank you, Felicia. It's great to see you. You haven't changed. You're gorgeous. <laughs> You're generous. You're as well. Wait, 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 wait. Okay. Okay, so you, you really believe he's... You think he's Duke? He is Duke. I promise you. <sighs> oh, all right. Well, then, in my defense, he looks exactly like a, a vampire. I... I just don't understand why I didn't see the resemblance at the time. At the time? What are you talking about? Alexis said that you attacked a police detective with a wooden stake. I did. I had no choice, and it's not a police detective. He's not John McBain. His name is Caleb Morley. Oh, now, slow down just a second. When did you start believing in vampires? Oh, Felicia. I, I, I really wanted to tell you. I, I really did before. It's just I didn't want to worry you. Well, guess what? We're worried. Okay, just listen. Stay with me. Uh, 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 about 10 years ago, in, in, in town, th th this band showed up, uh, uh, demons, and they, they started pretending to be a rock band and, 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 and a rock star and take over the town and seduce everybody with glamour and lights and fun. Mac has been the police commissioner for the past decade. Don't you think he would notice if there were creatures of the night roaming the streets? Of course, but he was hypnotized. Hypnotized. Yes, Caleb has this ability to mesmerize everyone, to, to make them forget everything that you remember. Yeah, because I'm the slayer. I'm not following us. I'm a vampire slayer. My job is to kill Caleb, and I failed, so now he's out there on the loose, and I am locked up in here. Please, you have to help me get out of here, and you have to please believe me. Okay, listen, I know this is way out there and ex extreme, but sometimes if you're really a friend, you have to take a leap of faith. So I'm asking you, could you trust me? I just want to know how I can help you. Okay, it's very simple. All you have to do is finish what I started. You 
want us to kill John McBain? Yes. His name is not John McBain. It's Caleb Morley. Listen, all you have to do is get something wooden. It has to be really sharp, and you've got to pierce his heart because apparently I failed. We I should have done better. We're not going to stake anyone, Lizzie. You just told me you wanted to help. Well, I will, by standing by you at your arraignment. Felicia, could I... Could I talk to you for a moment? Oh, sure. I... I don't think it's a good idea if I go to the arraignment. I mean, Lucy thinks that I was once a vampire, too. Hi. Oh, yeah, you have a good point. Maybe I'll go to the arraignment for both of us. Lucy, I'm sorry. I'm not going to be able to go to the arraignment, but I'm your friend. Please believe me. I'll always be your friend. If there's anything I can do for you, Fine. you just call me. I will, okay? but I... Listen, Duke, I appreciate that, but I want you to go after Caleb Morley. Hunt him down. Time for Miss Coe's arraignment. What? I, I don't even have a lawyer. You do now. <laughs> <laughs>